of course, the host of the season three of Deadliest Warrior. Guys, how you all doing today? Doing very fantastic. well. Very awesome. well, Ray. Awesome. Now, of course, there was a, a season, you guys got picked up for season three. You're almost wrapped on it. Can you give us maybe a little teaser about what we might see coming out of the box? Hell yeah. Well, I'm going to tell you, tonight we're actually going to announce a complete matchup. We're going to tell you who they're matched up. We talked about one of the guys. Now we're going to tell you about the other guy tonight. Yeah, and a uh, hint is that there's something that involves 9,000 pounds. <laughs> and for the first time on Deadly's Warrior, we have a woman warrior this season. And our anchor episode, when I mean out of the box, you're not going to believe it. Trust me. Very cool. Now, of course, Deadliest Warrior, it's just blowing up. You guys got a video game out there. You got a, There's works on a, of a movie. Like, how do you guys feel, you know, being the faces of this franchise that, you know, it's just taking off? Absolutely fantastic. And probably all this buzz is going to lend itself to a season four. <laughs> it's an honor and privilege. It Spike is. is the only place you could do something like this. It's been great talking about these warriors, looking at their lives, talking about all that stuff. But there's a crew and a, and a cast of people that go into making this thing happen, and they deserve a ton of respect in this process. So yeah, I totally love the fact that you know, doctor by day, deadliest warrior by night. I mean, I can't I can't find a better type of life. I mean, I'm very happy. It doesn't get better than this. Yeah, and on that note, actually, we've added. Besides Mac being one of the new additions, we're also getting Rob Daly, the head developer from Pipeworks, to run the simulator this year. So all the data that we're collecting off the weapons and the warriors is going directly into the Deadliest Warrior game. Um, plus, another really cool thing for me is I got a lab sequence now, so none of this hand waving on, about science out in the field. We're going to be cutting into my lab sequence. We've got diagrams, demos, to really give you a sense of the science behind these warriors and weapons that we're testing. Very cool. Now, you guys mentioned, of course, Mac, you're, you've been behind the scenes the first two years. Now you're on camera. How different was it for you guys to work with, you know, a, a bit of a new dynamic a little bit on screen and on camera with all these new features and whatnot? Well, actually, what I was doing was hosting and producing a show on Future Wep uh, on Discovery and Military Channel called Future Weapons. And before that, I was in SEAL Team for 10 years. So what happened is uh, Spike and I uh, were working on a deal. We came to a deal. There was an opportunity with Deadliest Warrior. Would you like to be a part of it? I said, of course. It's incredible. It's an incredible show. I'm very honored to be here. I'm excited to be a part of it. It's fantastic. Now, of course, guys, we're here for the video game awards. You guys have the downloadable game. Are you guys? Have you guys? Are you guys big players online? Are you guys big with your Deadliest Warrior game? I wouldn't call myself a hardcore gamer, but I'm definitely a gamer. I love all the new stuff. I grew up on Street Fighter, and that's why I like, you know, the Deadliest Warrior game. But, you know, taking that to a new level, I love all the Black Ops stuff. I mean, they even actually consulted with some of the warriors that came on our show and used them for mocap. So it's amazing stuff. And listen, the Deadliest Warrior game is awesome, but I also love all the stuff from Call of Duty, that whole franchise. I love anything that comes out of Bioware. I'm impressed. I can't wait to see THQ's Homefront coming out next year. It's going to be really incredible. Yeah, unfortunately, my gaming consoles have been dominated by my five-year-old boy, so I can't get in to play. And if I play, it's going to be Mario Brothers, so or Super Mario, and that's pretty much it. But I'm, I'm a gamer at heart. Very cool, guys. Again, congrats on the, on the third season almost wrapping up and all the success and continue, more continued success. I really, That's a lot, Ray. I really appreciate it.